Hello, my name is Steve Bowler, and in this video we're going to be taking a look at Border Gateway Protocol, otherwise known as BGP. Specifically within BGP, this is BGP Troubleshooting Lab Number 3. So in this lab we're going to be giving a couple of trouble tickets in which we have to fix. Let me just go over and explain the current network topology. We have six routers in this configuration or in this network diagram we have router 1, 2, and 3 which is in BGP Autonomous System 100 and we have RIP version 2 as the interior gateway protocol and then we have BGP Autonomous System 200 running on ISP R1, ISP R2, and ISP R3 and also we have RIP version 2 running as the IGP as well and between the two BGP autonomous systems we have two links we have a T1 1.5 meg link between R2 and ISP R1 and then we also have a T3 45 meg link between R3 and ISP R2 all of the configuration has been done and provided to us and what we're going to need to do now in this case is troubleshoot and fix a couple of problems within BGP. On router 1 we have three loopbacks, loopback 0, 1, and 2 all in the with the 1 networks and on ISP R3 we have three loopbacks as well we have the 50 network, the 188, and the 121 and between the service provider and the customer between R2 and ISP R1 we are running the 160.0.0.0/24 network and between the router 3 and ISP R2 we are running the 161.0.0.0/24 network and then between router 1, 2, and 3 we have the 192.168.123.0/24 network again this is, the, this is a multi-access network where router 1, 2, and 3 are all in the same subnet and also the same thing is going on on the ISP network except ISP R1, ISP R2, and ISP R3 are all connected to each other via fast user at 00, zero on, on the subnet 172.16.123.0/24 so let's go ahead and take a look at our trouble tickets again this is BGP troubleshooting lab number three so the first trouble ticket says that you have recently upgraded your network to a dual homed BGP configuration for redundancy and to a higher speed T3 internet connection 45 megs. Your network administrator has brought to your attention that during peak business hours your customers are experiencing latency. After further investigation you find that to get to networks behind the ISP the traffic is flowing over the backup T1 1.5 meg link. Configure the network so that the primary T3, the 45 meg link, is used to route all traffic out to the ISP. Do not configure a Cisco proprietary BGP attribute to complete this task. So in this trouble ticket it appears as though if we take a look at our network diagram it appears as though our customer is complaining that traffic is going across the link between R2 and ISP R1 again this is the slow link, this is the T1 link whereas the network administrator has expressed to us that the traffic should be flowing between R3 and ISP R2. Again, this is outbound traffic. This is traffic from our customer network 
out to the service provider.